For the past two weeks, the Atlanta Falcons held their rookie camp at Lake Lanier. But this week, their training was all about setting them up for success for off the field. I'm Ashley Cox reporting for Galvanize, and I spoke with head coach Dan Quinn and two rookies about making their NFL dreams a reality with family, faith, and football. Faith and sports is kind of a thing right now. Where is your intersection of that in your life? Well, for me, when I moved in with my, my grandparents when I was seven years old, that was kind of the staple of their life, and they kind of tried to implement it to me. Um, not that I took it well at, at first, um, but as I grew in my relationship with them and throughout my life, it kind of became a thing that how, how God opened doors for me, even through the process of getting here to the NFL, um, opened, opened doors for me to get where I am, even though I didn't agree with it at first or think it was the right thing, it ended up being the best thing for me. What are some of the ways that your grandparents lived out their faith that you applied to your life? Uh, well, when I, when I moved in with them, I, I moved in from a rough childhood. It was one that was really, really broken. Um, so moving in with them, I wasn't used to love or, you know, the affection they showed to each other and how they respected each other. And it wasn't um, a, a physical or a violent marriage. It was a, you know, a very peaceful and, and nice. And they were, you know, caring to me and they showed me affection and they, they loved me unconditionally. Um, and encouraged me and supported me in everything that I did. At what age or what time in your life did you take your faith on as your own completely? Uh, it probably wasn't until I got into high school that I really took it as my own. Um, that whole time I was kind of battling with my, myself and battling with my past. Um, I didn't really want to accept the things that they were you know, offering to me that, that had helped them throughout their life. Um, so it was probably, wasn't probably until high school that I, that I finally accepted it as my own through mentors and people that have, that have been there in my life through sports and um, family. How has your faith gotten you to this point in your football career? Uh, I think, like I said earlier, it's just it's opened a lot of doors for me that I, that I didn't think that I would be able to have got to before. Um, you know, I went through the Citadel and I didn't think I would ever be a, go to a military college. And, you know, whenever you see Never With God, you always seem to, <laughs> you always yeah. seem to have to go that route. And, you know, I went to a military college and, you know, going from a military college to the NFL, there's there's very few people who come from that that background to make it to the NFL, and I never thought it would be possible. Um, and through the help of you know different people and, and different doors being opened up that I, that I didn't ever see coming, um, it was it was powerful to see the growth in me and the growth um, throughout the journey. Tyler, thank you so much for your time. We appreciate it. Thank you.